My name is I Kusma Kumari. I am working at Government Junior College, Kondapi, Prakasam District. Today we will discuss Construction Technology, Second Year Subject, Construction Practice. The chapter is third one, Masonry. Masonry. Masonry is defined as the Masonry, it is the art of constructing structures. With, with the bricks or stones with mortar with mortar masonry is used for Constructing foundations columns walls Masonry. It is art of constructing structures with bricks or stones with mortar. Masonry is used for constructing foundations, columns and walls. Stone Masonry. It is a systematic arrangement of arrangement of stones bonding to, together bonding together with mortar to form a homogeneous mass homogeneous mass next Materials, materials required for stone masonry, for stone masonry. Number one, stones, two, mortar. stones the stones are selected upon the availability availability and architectural appearance the stones 
should be tough hard durable and free from free from any defects any defects mortar mortar is used mortar is used to keep the stones in a proper position in a proper position the mortar is prepared the mortar is prepared by mixing sand or by mixing sand and lime or cement and add water to this mixture to this mixture the mortar is used to fill the giants the proportion of mortar the proportion of the mortar will be depending will be depending on the strengthen strengthen and weathering resistant weathering resistant of the required work required these are two materials used in the stone masonry number 1 is stones number 2 is mortar stones the stones are selected upon the availability and architectural appearance the stones should be tough hard durable and free from all defects mortar mortar is used to keep the stones in a proper position the mortar is prepared by mixing sand or lime with <laughs> and add water to this mixture the mortar is used to fill the giants the proportion of the mortar will be depend on the strength and weathering resistance of the required work ante manam chese tatvante work yokka quality ni batti dan requirement ni batti మనం కలుపుకునేటటువంటి మోటార్ యొక్క ప్రపోర్షను డిపెండ్ అవుతుంది ఓకే నెక్స్ట్ used in stone masonry number 1 travel t 
to lift and spread mortar spirit level to check the horizontality of the work totality of the work third one plumb roll to check the verticality of the work fourth one square to set the right angles to set the right angles line and pins to check the alignment of work ball hammer to dress the stones mosh hammer to dress the stones x to split the stones pitching tool to size making jumper to tools used in stone masonry number 1 trowel trowel oka upayogam ente ante to lift and spread the mortar spirit level to check the horizontality of the work plumb roll to check the verticality of the work square to set the right angles line and pins to check the alignment of work small hammer to dress the stones mosh hammer to dress the stones 
X to split the stones. Pitching tool to size making. Jumper to bore the holes into quarry. Next. Ashlar Masonry Ashlar Masonry In this Masonry In this Masonry The stones are used in regular size of squares or rectangular blocks types of ashlar Masonry Ashlar Fine Ashlar Rough Tooled Ashlar Quarry Faced Ashlar Chamfer Types of Ashlar Masonry Ashlar Fine Ashlar Rough Tool Ashlar Quarry Faced Ashlar Chamfer Ashlar Fine In Ashlar Fine the stones of beds and all sides are dressed with chisel. This is costly construction. Costly construction. Ashla rough told only one face is dressed three sides are roughly dressed Ashla Champard this is massive appearance. Ashlar masonry. In this masonry, the stones are used in regular size of square or rectangular blocks. Types of ashlar masonry. Ashlar fine. In this Masonry, the stones of the beds and all sides are dressed with chisel. This is costly construction. Ashlar rough tooled, only one face is dressed. Ashlar quarry faced, three sides are roughly dressed. Ashlar chamfered, this is massive appearance. Write the types of giants 
write the types of giants used in stone masonry but giant rebated giant tongued and grooved giant plugged giant rusticated giant doveled giant some of this type of giants are used in stone mason number 1 bud giant number 2 rebated giant number 3 tongued and grooved giant number 4 plugged giant number 5 rusticated giant number 6 doveled giant next write the supervising points while constructing stone masonry the stones are selected the requirement of the the requirement of the specification of specification of work all the stones should be well watered before use to prevent absorb absorbing water water from motor third one all the stones should be laid on their natural beds fourth one no stone pieces are not used in stone work for every for every 1 meter length the bond stone the bond stone should be provided should be provided
double scaffolding is used at higher level of work stone masonry should be raised uniformly we check the stone work with line and pins and plumb rule and spirit level and spirit level after construction of work we should well watered for 2 or 3 weeks this is the stone masonry supervising points <coughs> the formation of the formation of continuous vertical joints should be avoided should be avoided write the supervising points while constructing the stone mason number 1 the stones are selected the requirement of the specification of work ante mana work ku kalsina twenty size shape specification prakaram manam select cheskovali second one all the stones should be well watered before use to prevent absorbing water from mortar man construction cheyabeya mundala stones mottanni water tho tadipinatlayite aa mortar lo unnatuvanti water ni absorb cheyakunda untundi third one all the stones should be laid on their natural bed prathi okka stone kuda natural bed meede manu lay cheyali fourth one no stone pieces are not used in stone work chin chin small pieces unte stones lo avi vaadakoddu for every 1 meter length the bond stone should be provided construction lo okokka meter ku okokka bond stone anedi manam provide cheyatam jarugutundi double scaffolding is used at higher level of the work stone masonry should be raised uniformly ఆల్ సైడ్స్ కూడా ఒకేల హైట్ రైట్ చేసుకుంటూ పోవాలి సమానంగా వి చెక్ ద స్టోన్ వర్క్ విత్ లైన్ అండ్ పిన్స్ అండ్ ప్లంబ్ రూల్ అండ్ స్పిరిట్ లెవెల్ ఆఫ్టర్ కన్స్ట్రక్షన్ ఆఫ్ వర్క్ వి షుడ్ వెల్ వాటర్ ఫర్ టూ ఆర్ త్రీ వీక్స్ ద ఫార్మేషన్ ఆఫ్ కంటిన్యూస్ వర్టికల్ జాయింట్స్ షుడ్ బి అవాయిడ్ వరుసగా వర్టికల్ జాయింట్స్ వచ్చినట్లయితే వాటిని మనం అవాయిడ్ చేయాలి దిస్ ఇస్ ది స్టోన్ మ్యాస్ అంటారు